This is a project I've been working on that uses a thermal imaging sensor. I believe the resolution is 32 by 32. On this board, it's powered by an ESP32S3. Uh, it has a USB-C port, two momentary push buttons, which are used only for bringing up the COM port when you first plug it in. For uh, ske regular sketch uploads, you never have to hit these buttons. It has a power switch, a uh, LiPo connector, um, two, um, two push buttons if you want to create some type of menu. It has the 3.3-volt um, LDO battery charger. It has a green light when you plug it in the USB-C port. It has a red light for charging. And that is the um, LiPo battery monitor chip. It's all put on the back of a um, 1.69 inch LCD where the they are very thin and uh, 12 pin have an SPI interface and that's what it looks like when it's powered up. It has the little uh, battery icon there and the crosshairs tell you the temperature um, of that area. So I'm just going to bring over my Soldering iron. There it is there. Temperature went way up. It's pretty good at finding um, hot spots on a circuit board if you have a short somewhere. Um, and the refresh rate is uh, for SPI interface is, is pretty good. It is a little bit glitchy because I have the I squared C bus and the SPI bus maxed out. But uh, so far it works pretty well. The antenna, I've been messing around with uh, Nano VNA. And this is, this is what it looks like there. So to test this board, I just have the SMA connector on there. I mounted the LCD and the um, connector because they will both affect the antenna performance. So um, the green is the uh, tuning capacitors. And I believe the yellow is the SWR for this board. I had to add two capacitors right there and to bring the uh, SWR into position, I had to trim some of that copper off the end of the little antenna. Um, antenna performance is pretty well, but I'm still trying to figure things out. This project is open source, and I'll provide the um, Gerber files, bill of materials, if you'd like to make your own. I have a similar one on Tindy that uses a 8-bit uh, bus and has a, a black circuit board. It looks like a, Looks like that. Anyway, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.